What is up everybody, I'm your Legendary Commander, and welcome back to Baldur's Gate 3. In this video, we're going to show you when is the best time to betray Gortash. So the first opportunity we get to actually betray him is also the first time we actually get to interact with him at all, is at his coronation. Now, I will immediately tell you, this is a bad idea. Now, I'm sure there is some finagling and stuff you can do to really enhance your chances here, but this is not a good area. If you look around, there are plenty of Steel Watchers. I believe there are about seven to eight Steel Watchers plus guards. However, if you do choose to attack him, ignore my warning. Try to do it not during the dialogue sequence. At least you'll get a free hit in that way, whereas any other way, you'll be fighting a fair fight. Which fighting here is anything but a fair fight, so you can't really give him a fair fight. And while I don't advise this one, I'm sure it's possible. You just probably want to be max level and decked out to the teeth. I'd highly suggest going and getting Raphael's armor uh, beforehand. And all his other vestiges, just so you have every ounce of extra help. Now, we move on to the second one. Uh, this opportunity is after you beat Orin. If you kill Orin and then come back to Gortash, Gortash moves upstairs to his more private quarters, area, office, whatever it might be. This area is far less protected. It has mines and other things you can accidentally step on and detonate, but you're going to meet him, so you're probably not going to detonate those mines. His room up there is very, very dangerous, but the number of steel watchers is down to four, and his guards are down to three. Once again, I wouldn't want to step in there unless I had all the best gear I could have, because, well, it's not a fair fight. And this is another fight, again, you can engage before a dialogue sequence. I highly suggest never actually engaging in dialogue sequences and just kicking the door in. That's the best way to do the fights in Baldur's Gate. It gives you the best chance at winning a fight because you at least get that surprise in. Whereas clicking attack in the dialogue sequence actually just goes ahead and starts the fight and gives everybody a fair shake. Now, while I said this one is a much better opportunity, it is definitely not the best opportunity. The best opportunity is to betray Gortash in the third one. The third opportunity presents the opportunity to attack him when he's completely by himself down in the Morphic Pool where you're going to confront the Elder Brain and take control of it. This would be a good opportunity as he is completely by himself and there are even not some opportunities. Well, my first encounter with him actually was more of a fight. There are opportunities like the one you're seeing here where he messes himself up and it's pretty easy to just betray him. However, there is a really important note to take here. No matter what, you really shouldn't betray Gortash, and you might be wondering why. And the answer is pretty simple. Because he'll get himself killed. The Nether Brain, as the Elder Brain becomes, uh, essentially will just kill him. And you will get all three Nether Stones and get your Reign of Choice. So even if you're a Paladin and don't want to go along with him, and have every intention maybe to betray him at some point, but you made that oath, and now you don't want to break that oath, well, you don't really have to, because the nether brain will take care of it. It is a bit sad to see an end where you can't actually end the game with Gortash alive. I don't know why you want to see him alive, but it would have been nice to see. That said, these are your options. I honestly suggest not betraying him at all and saving yourself from the struggle, unless you just really want to fight him. But guys, that is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure to tell your friends. But you all take care. And I will catch you next time.